What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we're out here, we're on the boat. We're, we're about to do some big things, hopefully. This is going to be a kind of like a challenge video for me because I haven't really came out here in the summer and actually caught fish. So we're going to try and find fish today. We're going to try and catch fish today, but hopefully we're going to. Today's video is sponsored by Carl's Bait and Tackle. We're up here on the boat. We're using some baits off of there. Everything I'll be using today, you guys can find there. And also, if you guys have not ordered anything from Carl's Bait and Tackle, you guys can click the link in the description, and you guys can use Logan10 at checkout and save 10% off your entire order, which is pretty cool. Save some money on some tackle. We're out here at the spot. It's looking like it has potential, and it looks like we're also in a uh, gator den because we've seen a baby gator, and we saw a big wake and lots of air bubbles. So, you know, we might get jumped by some alligators today, which uh, should be fun. But it should be a good day. I'm ready to catch some fish, hopefully. I'm ready to try and figure out my skills of finding fish in the heat. I got some new rigs tied up I think should work today. Should be interesting. I'm, I'm just really hoping we catch some fish. But uh, we got a nice day. Water temperature over here is 86, which is not ideal, especially in two foot of water. Oh, gosh. So uh, maybe making a move here. But this spot produced really good last time we came. So we're going to hit this, and uh, hopefully we catch some fish. Let's go ahead and start throwing them around. All right, so I'm starting off with a little Guggen Baits rattling chunk on a little shaky head. Hear that little rattle in there? I'm hoping that's gonna help us out today. Let's go ahead, get first cast, see what see what's happening here. Let's see, just with this thing, I put some new line on. So I just want to catch a fish today. You know, I always like to not hype up. The fishing trips because we usually get skunked but i'm just gonna go ahead and call it i'm catching a big today it might be a big alligator it might be a big bass probably more likely a big alligator but i'm okay with that oh you got one. Oh, oh, get him up here flip him flip him why do you always catch the fit whoa man don't hit me upside the head with him what in the crap were you going fast or slow oh what is that that's a gar Oh my God, it's a big gar. I have something. I do, I think. Fish, oh gosh, what is it? It's a bass. Get up here. Come on, little buddy. I was like, something's just swimming with it. Woo hoo hoo. Yes, no skunk, baby. Look at that little dude. Wow. Let's go. Oh, I got him. Good. Look at that. Right in the face hole. All right, right here, number one on the rattling chunk. A little black and blue action. I was just popping it, and I'm like, my line looks like it's swimming off, and it actually was. This dude right here had it, and I just jacked his jaws. Look at this. He's got like a weird little nose thing right there. That is so weird, like a little bubble. I don't know. Weird fish, but first one of the day. Let's go ahead and get him back. All right, see you, little dude. Thank you so much. First fish of the day. Hopefully, you're the first fish of many. See you, man. He's just, he just wants to come back, I think. He's just, he's just chilling. Boom. Let's go. <laughs> Makes no sense why there's bass back here, but... I'm not complaining, I'm not arguing. I feel like I just gotta bite it. I'm not gonna lie, when I set the fish on that first when I set the hook on that first fish, all I had in my mind was the disappointment of feeling whenever you set it and nothing's on it. Because it's happened multiple times out here. And then I felt the resistance and I was happy. <laughs> I'm trying to put my hood on, struggling. I got one. Fish. Oh, he feels decent. Oh my gosh. What? I got a giant bowfin. Net, net, net. Oh my God. That's a freaking giant, 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 giant. Net him. Hurry, 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 hurry. Net him. Oh, 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 he came off. Oh my gosh. What the heck? Look at this freaking toad. I guess up on the front deck. That looks very, oh my. 
Dude, look how aggressive he is. Yeah, I don't really, I've never held one of these things, and they have sharp teeth, I've seen and heard. You want me getting? Oh my, he's a giant. Look at the, like, the thing on his head. Ah! <laughs> don't hit my camera! Yeah, you can, you can try. Have fun with that. I'm thinking he's a little too hyper for my liking. Dude, there's just so much life back here. Look at this thing. There he goes. Oh my god, look at him. Yeah, I've never held one, and I don't want to get eaten. And he's just real slimy and very hyper. Where are we at? Are we are we in Jurassic Park? What what's happening? We're just finding dinosaurs of species we've never caught, like big old alligator gars, big old bowfins. I'm not the I'm not the craziest about grabbing those things because of the teeth on those things, and they're just real slippery and stuff, and uh, just not a good experience. I like the bass because you grab the bass, they may shake one two times and then they're done. You know that thing. The whole time he was on the boat, he was just shaking and causing a scene. But uh, the rattling chunk, just he ate the rattling chunk. Big bowfin. I've never seen one that big. We caught one the last time we were in the spot, and it was maybe a foot long. That one was, he was probably four, three. I don't know. Big fish. That was really fun, really crazy. I thought I had a big bass, man. I'll take it, though. Let's get back, see what else we can catch out here. Who knows, maybe even hook into a 14-foot uh, alligator here soon. So stay tuned. Just tell him what's back here. Let's just recap. We've seen a baby alligator, we've seen a bowfin, we've seen an alligator gar, we've seen two bass, and we've seen a big alligator. So that's what's that's what's happening up in here. I don't know what what the, what it is about this little cove thing right here, but all kinds of stuff. Oh yeah, we also saw a carp. So we're about all we gotta do now is see a bluegill. And, you know, I think that might be the species list. <laughs> Big old bow thing. Little help, little help. Get the net, get the net, get the net. Go! <laughs> what is this? Where are we at? Where are we at? Oh gosh! Oh! Oh my god! <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh! Where's, is my lure still in his mouth? Oh, oh, oh! He's like, like shelling himself. Oh, it's so weird. Does he still have my lure in his mouth? I think it got out. Oh! <laughs> Dude, these things are crazy. <laughs> oh my God. What if you like grab his lip and then... <laughs> Get out of our <laughs> <laughs> Got some slime in the boat for show. Oh, what the crap. All right, since the bowfin are eating all my, my rattling chunks, we gotta grab some more. All right, here, black and blue. That's what we're running with. All right, let's keep on going here. I'm, I'm just, I'd rather catch a 10 pound bass instead of a giant bowfin. I think I have something. Fish, bass, little guy, pimp squeak. They just love the rattling chunk. There's something about it. Oh! Keep getting them in the same place too, right in the cheek. The one up in the face area, not the other area. Another little bass, tiny little guy. Nothing too crazy. We're catching fish. It's literally, we're in two foot of water. Water temp's 87. These little guys are just having picnics, man. See ya, dude. The rattling chunk. Love this thing. Throwing it on a little shaky head. That thing just sits there, rattles on the bottom. Bass, bowfin, everything above likes them. 
All right, spot number one was a success. I don't know how this happened. We must have just got lucky today. I don't know. That spot always has reduced in the past, but we call I caught two or three bass, I can't remember, and then two giant bow fins. It was an interesting spot, let's say that. We're about to drive around, get some cool air, and then uh, maybe hit some offshore stuff, maybe try and find a different cove that looks sort of like that one. I'm not real sure yet. Maybe even hunt some alligators, but let's go ahead. I'll see you guys in the next spot. Seventeen foot. This is probably a good place to throw a Carolina rig. What do we want to throw though? No, I'm just going Mondo worm. If I'm gonna go, if I'm gonna throw this thing, I'm going big or I'm going home. I want a big boy. I want a big bass. I've never thrown a Carolina rig, and I feel like this is probably not the best bait to start off with because I'm throwing it as an absolute giant twelve-inch worm. But go big or go home, like I said. Oh. I think I just got a bite. What the crap? So we decided to come farther up north and hit some creeks. And we're, you know, we're driving the boat and we pull up and we just see something wake, just really hard and aggressive. And then we we figured out it was an alligator, right? So then we uh we wait a second and he comes back up. And then we can see him. We're really far away at this point, and he's about 14 foot probably. He's an absolutely giant alligator like this this alligator has been eating he's been chewing up some stuff he's probably eating all the 10 pounders over here maybe there's some fish around i don't know this dinosaur has been eating it all but uh wow that was kind of freaky not gonna lie i've never seen an alligator that big and uh to be about 10 foot away from him i'm gonna have nightmares tonight but you know it's all good uh it was a pretty cool experience uh he's he's farther away now and i feel better about the whole situation but god it's a big alligator Oh my god, I wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> oh gosh. I wasn't even paying attention. Just slurp my buzz bait. Oh. Biggest of the day for the bass at least. Wow, you can tell I wasn't paying attention. He got it. Oh gosh. In the strangest way. He just tail kicked me in the place where the sun does not shine. Oh, wow. Well, you know, with the buzz bait, it just always works, you know. Didn't pick it up, give it no love all day. Catch this one right here. Got a little noggin on him. Look at that. <laughs> I hit it like a pad, and then just he exploded on it. A real dark fish. He's just been sitting up in this. Oh, gosh, there's more fish back here. He's just been sitting in all this grass. Not a bad one. All right, thanks, dude. See you later. Biggest bass of the day. Just totally ripped up my thumb, which is a good sign. I don't want to be able to grab anything with my with my thumb. I, I just looked away and then it was gone. I heard a little bloop and then I looked over. And I was like, huh, I don't hear the squeaking of it anymore. And then I saw the wake on it and I just decided to set the hook. Let's see if we can get a few more to come out back here. All right, last spot of the day. Conveniently, this was the first spot of the day. Oh, I got something. Fish, little bass, I think. Get up here. Oh my gosh, look at that thing. Oh my gosh. Freaking cranked him. Holy crap, look at the colors on this little guy. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, check out this little dude. Oh my gosh, look at him. That is such, so cool. Look, he's got like red eyes. I don't know if the camera can see it, but such a cool looking fish. Right at dawn. God, his eyes are freaky. Pretty cool catch. Let's see if we can catch some more fish. All right, see you, dude. Thank you. Something just blew up over there. Chunk it over behind you. Look behind you over there. Oh, I got something. Got him. I don't know what it is. It's a bass. It's a pretty solid one. Oh, gosh. He just flew out of the water. 
got now? Bass. I'm just multi in up here. Oh, that was a sick shot. I guarantee the camera claw just hit the camera. The camera claw? The crawl? Look at that. Look at that bass. Oh, what the crap is all over him? You There's like little bumps all over this fish. Okay, that's kind of disgusting. I'm getting him back. Adios. Nasty fish. All right, we're throwing a little Bama bug. Rattling chunk because I'm out of black and blue. They've been eating it up. This one's probably most similar, I would think. Still got that darker profile. Today was a really, really solid day. We caught lots of fish. Um, saw a lot of alligators. Saw an absolutely giant alligator. And it was just it was just kind of a wild day, I'm not gonna lie. But it was still a solid day. I think I caught maybe five, six bass, maybe even seven. It was somewhere around there. But I did think I did catch my biggest bass out of here so far. So I'm pretty proud about that. And uh, I'm exhausted. It's been a long day. Lots of fishing, lots of fish put in the boat, which is a good thing mosquitoes on me they're they're eating me up out here so gotta make this snappy but if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like and a comment if you guys want to check out any of the stuff i use today it will be linked in the description to shop carls and if you guys are new to the channel make sure to subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one